Hello viewers and welcome back to part 11 of Evil West. I hope you enjoyed the video and I'll see you in the next one. Turning the tides, my ass. <clears throat> More like lining in your own pockets, you slimy shit. What the hell are you? Ah, Biddle. Oopsie daisy. You sent two dozen National Guardsmen to their deaths for a paycheck. When the president gets wind of this, you're a Some people dead are just scrubbed it, eh? <laughs> I mean, what can they do? Oh, I'm sorry. It's just that the way the veins in your forehead are throbbing, it's so <laughs> comical. Mr. Assistant Secretary, these accusations sound serious, and... First of all, it's Mr. Secretary now. As in Secretary of War, as in the fucking right hand of God. Uh, Secondly, you know. do you think the President of these United States is gonna give a royal fuck about the pissant accusations of a podunk... <laughs> Go ahead, Rentier, do it. Give me a reason to throw your cowpoke ass in a new gate and flens your father's legacy to the bone. The Harrow Institute has a much better ring to it, don't you think? Mr. Secretary, maybe it would be for the best if you... Maybe it would be best if you stopped interrupting me, you groveling mule! You want to make yourself useful? Get to the kitchen and fetch me a cup of coffee! <laughs> Now fuck off and find or a sandwich or something. You. That's much more your speed. Uh, uh. Right. right. Shut up, boy. Mr. Rentier, your father's waiting for you. But and its longevity. I'm surprised. Virgil and I were just having the most invigorating discussion. I was telling Director Rent here about my ideas for upgrading the gauntlet. Huh. I must say it's refreshing to see young blood like Mr. Olney's coursing through Calico. We'll need his vital spirit if we're to rebuild the Institute's power and vigor. Well done, son. I think we may have given him a few too many vaults. Glad to see you're in good shape, but uh, we've got a situation. In order to keep your condition quiet, Amelia told Harrow you died. He's pulled rank and is sending us out on money grubbing errands while Felicity's building her army. Harrow's head knows what's right, but his heart is tainted by lust for power and money. Uh, it's gonna get worse now that he got promoted. One wrong move and we're dead in the water. The one right move, and you could catch her and end this war on the subject of moving. You know what? Maybe let's wait for the dog to give the all clear before we start unbinding anyone. Oh, Edgar. Harrow's not an idiot. Without the Institute, this country would turn into a blood feast. Now, you tell me, son. What's more important? His approval or ending this war before it started? What did you see while Felicity was in your head? Death. Death. Horrible monsters appearing out of nowhere. Fire, fire smoke, everything. And boxcars. Scores of them. Filled with blood. That's how she's transporting the leeches now? By train? That's not good, sirs. Dickinson is a major cattle railway hub. The trains run in all directions. If there's an outbreak, we won't be able to contain it. <clears throat> all right, here we go. Jesus Christ, what happened here? Thousand crap.
dude. No match for you. You were so, you were so easy to beat, man. Ah, oh, not a Batman! Ah! Oh. Okay, that guy's down. Let's go, Batman! You wanna mess with me? No! I was doing so good though. I, I just didn't realize my health was that low. Let's go die, man, already! Die! Yes, yes, yes! Okay, now I can deal with these guys. Yeah, die! Come on, come on. Slow down, slow down. No, I don't want to give you a hug. I want to kill you. Dead. <sighs> Finally. Man, that was a tough fight. I'm getting better internet today. Hopefully. I've been struggling uploading the videos. It takes me like a whole day to upload a video. Okay, I can't stand it anymore. So I'm probably gonna record for another like half an hour. I 
we're not lost. I know exactly where I am. What's going on here? Can be lucky I can't go in there. Say nice. Let's see. Shoot! Ah, uh, that was so close. Yeah, 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 yeah. Nice, nice, nice. Okay. Good night. Sleep tight. We got one more. We got one more. We got one more over here. No, sorry. Let's fire him! Let's go, let's go, let's go! Shotgun! Uh-huh, uh-huh! Let's fire his ass! Ah! Die, 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 die! Get back, get back, get back, get back, get back! And then we flash him! Flash! Boom! Good night, sir! Sleep tight! Man! A train, huh? Don't think you're gonna make it in time, girl. That was a tough fight. Longer than what, what I expected, though. You dog! Oh, you flashed me! Oh man! 
on! Laser beam? Or be acid? What, what is it? Focus on the big boy first. No, no, come down here. Okay, okay. Yes. Yeah, yeah. annoying okay he's down uh oh I'm too quick I'm too quick let's go let's go let's go quick draw my friend you want a quick draw Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Quick draw. You want a quick draw? Ba! Oh man. That would have been a cool clip though. You are annoying. I always get what I want. No, you don't. Not today, young lady. She's still here, which means the transports aren't ready. Must have caught her off guard. And now she's scared I might be able to stop her. Good. Parkour. I'm like the flash now. Rail gun. Ooh. Eight thousand. Man. Starts getting expensive. Between the hunter and its prey, an understanding. 
Getting smooth with these dodges, though. You always treasure around. And now you take us out on the world. Exploited. Man, we work on your issues. Foot on those with inherited wealth. We survived. So they could thrive. I was barely living and hoping to die when he found me and gave me a choice. Should have died. The price I had to pay was giving up the memory of human warmth. To begin my new life, I had to <coughs> bury my past. Now all that to do that, uh, you stupid. You don't do that, what's the point of living? Just stay the same person. Don't gang up on me like that, man. You're gonna pay the price. Shoot the damn TNT, man. What the hell are, are you shooting?
now. No one deserves a life filled with fear and pain. Not even William Rentier. Why are you rubbing the leech like that, man? <laughs> Disgusting. All aboard! The train's about to leave the station. <laughs> <gasps> Do you hear them singing? That's humanity's requiem. You can be mankind's last sad note, or you can be part of a new opening chord of progress. <sighs> It's only natural to feel fear while standing on the precipice of change. Yeah, but this is shit change Sometimes though. No, like, I mean, not all change is good. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> what the hell is this thing now? Let it break poor William's heart. <laughs> Ugly. And that's the end of the video. Goodbye.